So you remember this. This is my Picasso-ish page from uh, the play date I had with Gigi back in June and we ran a very quick contest to um, kind of get some ideas as to how to finish this page. This page here was used to um, just clean up my brush. So I think I'm going to uh, write the quote here and somehow I will try to incorporate these streaks in the other page so that there's uh, continuity. But the way I want to write the quote, and by the way, the the one that won the quote is Lucy Phillips, and we both chose <laughs> the quote from Lucy. Uh, I was choosing for, for Gigi, and she was choosing for me. I do apologize for the traffic in the background, but hope it's not too annoying. I'm going to try and do something about that in the edit, but in case I do not, I do apologize. Uh, so for this page, Lucy had uh, suggested a quote by Audrey Hepburn. It uh, is the following, the best thing to hold on to in life is each other. And the way this was interpreted is, um, this is a lady. That's another lady, another lady. I call them my peoples. <laughs> and she is kind of embracing these two. She's got her arms around them, kind of. And this is a mother and child. So I'm going to... I have an aqua painter here. I think this one is by Letra Set. This is a Tria Letra Set aqua painter. I had this from years ago. And I'm going to fill this in with um, India ink. This brand I have had for years and it's a little gloppy so I may mix in a tiny bit of water with it but I don't normally use it because and I don't like the dropper it's too large at the tip so I'm gonna use it with my aqua painter and who knows maybe this is going to be my new way of uh, writing quotes. So I'm gonna get to work.
Um, remember these from Chatterbox? These are journaling genies. Back in my supposedly scrapbooking days, I bought these. There's some great lines here that I can use. So instead of using just straight up lines, I think I'm going to um, trace those. So the quote says, the best thing to hold on to in life is each other. Okay. So I'm trying to break this down. I was practicing. <laughs> the best thing to hold on to in life is each other. So one, two, three, four, five, five lines. That sounds good. Okay. So I think I want to start with, I'm going to start by the middle here. Okay, here we go. I don't think I'm holding my brush properly. I'll have to work on that, but it's fine. Don't. <laughs> I have a Pitt Artist Pen, uh, the excess tip, extra small, and I'm going to create some movement around the letters. gel pen because I really liked to use it the other day and it doesn't clog up on me so I think the white one is going to be added to the right I guess Yeah. 
Hmm. Yeah, I should have broken that up, but I didn't. Oh well. It's a learning experience for me, guys. <laughs> can I add to this? I feel like I should... These lines are way too fat for my taste, so I need to do something about that. Maybe embellish them in a way so that they become part of, I don't know, something. <laughs> I have no idea. somehow feel that this should be anchored to that page so I'm thinking of adding a swirl I will kind of join the the baby with the gold or something let's try that I'll trace it with a pencil and I'll see what it looks like yes definitely that Okay, think then. <laughs> okay, now I have to make sure that this is also done with the ink. <laughs> Maybe it's like it looks like a snake. <laughs> Uh, now I'm just playing. I just sent a picture to Gigi and she says it's done so it's done <laughs> so that's it um, I like it much better than what it looked like before I think the addition of more white here um, 
brings out these figures and also the fact that I've added the stripes going this way to that page. I think it's good. Loved writing with this. I'm going to practice some more for sure because this is a lot of fun. Um, I'm going to show you again the details of the letters. So I also like this detail, the fine, fine detail that I've added to the left of it and the white lines. I think it just adds movement to the letter because that's all about the movement. So uh, again, thank you so much, Lucy, for the quotes. And Gigi sent me a picture of her page, so I will tag that at the end with mine. And thanks again for watching. As usual, if you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them below. And I will see you later. Bye!